Welcome back to GearWire.com. I'm Owen O'Malley, and this is the Fender Classic Series Phaser. A uh, pretty tubby pedal. We've got a little tube screamer right next to it for a comparison. It's about the size of um, a crybaby, maybe uh, even a little bit uh, portlier. Uh, but it's got some pretty cool uh, features, especially for a phaser pedal. It's got a uh, well, obviously, the main unique thing about this guy is that it's got a big uh, jog dial that is the rate control up at the top, along with some pretty, you know, psychedelic uh, red and blue LEDs. Doesn't sound so cool when you call them red and blue LEDs, but if you call it psychedelic lighting, well, that doesn't sound cool either. Um, it's a pretty good sounding phaser. Uh, you can get it for, it's a little over 100 bucks. Uh, it's really ruggedly built. It's the same kind of like sort of die cast steel as like a crybaby, crybaby would be. Uh, and it's uh, the, it runs off a, a nine volt battery, which is included, uh, or you can power it off of, uh, you know, a nine volt wall wart. Uh, it's very simple controls. In addition to the rate control up on the top, we have over on the side, this is a frequency control. Now this controls the range, or rather the, the sort of center frequency of the, of the sweep. So let's just engage it and listen to what that sounds like. From a very sort of like, at the, at the low end of its frequency, a very sort of vocal. Very vocal range to a very sort of airy, almost indistinct range up at the top. I mean, really, it's not even there all the way at the top of the range, but up here. And then the dial over on the side here is the intensity dial. So we can, let's bring this back to a sort of more noticeable range. We'll dial the intensity back. Uh, and it sounds pretty great in front of a distortion pedal. Let's bring the intensity down probably about midway here. You can hear the range of the jog dial uh, is it's pretty intense. The only kind of complaint I have about it is that it's, well, down here it's really slow. It's fine, that's, that's not really a complaint. Um, it's just as you bring it up, it's got this very sort of gradual increase in frequency and then all of a sudden it's like, in just super fast all of a sudden in this very small range. Which, you know, it's designed to be manipulated by your feet. And uh, your feet aren't very dexterous. Uh, at least mine aren't. Quite an awesome range on this thing. Uh, with, uh, paired with a distortion, it can go from these really sort of like cool psychedelic tones. <laughs> sounding like, I'm going to go and say it, Mars Volta-ish sounds. Thank <laughs> you. 
is the Fender Classic Series phaser. Uh, a pretty unique phaser. Um, it's got this cool foot control here. Uh, pretty affordable phaser too, as far as, uh, as phasers go. A little over 100 bucks. Um, that's all. You've been watching GearWire.com. I'm Owen O'Malley, and thank you for stopping by.